Hello, welcome to this channel Gain Java Knowledge and today in this video we are going to learn how to use join method of string class that was introduced in JDK 1.8. The java.lang string join method concatenated the given elements with the delimiter and returns the concatenated string in the response. For example, we have a list of numbers in the form of string 1 2 3 4 and we want to print this all elements in a single string and we want to add one common delimiter so we can use string dot join method and we can get the output like this one is less than two two is less than three three is less than four and there are two types of join methods in the java string so these are the two method signature in one method we can pass the delimiter and list of elements and in the second signature we can pass the delimiter and we can pass multiple string values okay let's see in the code how to use these two method signatures so here first i will print so here first i will add list of string so we need to import this class and also need to import list class so now inside our list of numbers we have four element one two three four now i need to add delimiter one less than two two less than three three less than four then i will call string dot join method and inside join method the first parameter will be the delimiter which delimiter we want to use so here i will use less than delimiter and the next we need to pass list of numbers so here i will just copy and paste these numbers here so now i will just assign string output so now i will print the output and will check the response how it will work Okay, let's run this application. So here we can see the response like 1 is less than 2, 2 is less than 3, and 3 is less than 4. So this is the output and join method was introduced in JDK 8. And the second signature was we can pass delimiter and multiple string values. So how we can pass multiple string values? So here I will just like string output to is equal to string dot join and inside this first we need to pass the delimiter. So after that we can pass any number of element. Wake up then we eat then play after that we sleep then again wake up so like this you can pass multiple elements then we need to print this output so let's print so I will just copy this variable name and we paste here. Okay, let's run this application again and check the output. So here we can see the output. Wake up, eat, play, sleep and again wake up. So like this we can use string.join method. So thanks for watching this video.